Camila Cabello reacts to body shamers. Sean Mendes apparently got ghosted by Billie Eilish. Ariana Grande might have a new boyfriend. Plus, are Katie Taylor and Selena making music together? Hey guys, it's Allie for Hollywood Life with your pop star roundup, starting with Selena Gomez, who's attending a birthday party for her friend's dog. For her friend's dog. Okay. Yeah. To more interesting news, Selena's reportedly going to collab with Taylor Swift and, wait for it, Katy Perry. One of Taylor's biggest fans claims that she attended her secret recording session and there's a track about women's empowerment featuring the trio. Amazing, but I feel like it could use a sprinkle of Ariana Grande and Casey Musgraves to make it a real smash hit. You know what I'm saying? Now, speaking of Ariana Grande, she seems to have a new boy slash friend who happens to be on her new single, Boyfriend, Social House's Mikey. Let me preface this reporting by saying we did have the exclusive a few days ago and even dropped some hints in a past roundup of videos, but we couldn't flat out say until we had something more solid. You know what I'm saying? However, it seems like other outlets got the scoop as well because the blast is reporting the two have been seeing each other for the past couple of months. However, the site also claims they're not exactly boyfriend-girlfriend yet. They're still figuring things out. But okay, on to Shawn Mendes. He recently did a Q&A in Nashville and revealed Billie Eilish never returned a recent text and also what his next tattoo will probably be. Yeah. Okay, okay did Billie ever reply to your tattoo? She never did. Um, I don't know. I think I want to get the word surrender, which is kind of the similar phrase to let, just let go, let it go and surrender to life being the way it is. On to Camila because she will not surrender to people body shaming her. Recall fans speculated Camila was going on an unfollowing spree on Twitter after Stan accounts were shaming her body and her romance with Sean. Well, now Camila wrote a lengthy letter to her Instagram story clapping back at Shamila haters saying, I haven't gone on social media at all with the conscious intention of avoiding things that hurt my feelings, but for a second I forgot while trying to find a pic to post about it being Havana's two-year anniversary, and my eyes accidentally ran over a headline of people body shaming me. Camila goes on to say she immediately felt super insecure and worried over what the photos may look like, that cellulite was showing, and that she didn't suck in her stomach. Eventually, Camila got over it, revealing she's not going to let the airbrush world of social media make her think that that's the new normal, ending her message with, girls, cellulite's normal, that is normal, it's beautiful and natural, I won't buy into the BS today. Not today, Satan, and I hope you don't either. What a G. Quickly also have to note that another ex-5H member isn't letting haters get to her. Recently, a fan threw shade at Normani saying, every time I see Normani perform, I feel like she hasn't graduated Beyonce school yet. To which she replied, then don't watch. You know what I'm saying? But all right, hit the sub, like, and bell button for all the latest updates. Don't forget to follow me on social media at Ali Stagnita. And let us know what the greatest clapback of all time is in the comments below.